so you must measure the base of the bra cup like this and it must have a total at least of 6 rows 100% acrylic DK yarn a scissor stitch markers and a measuring tape to, to begin just try to grab the metal yarn from inside like this to begin with a bra cup make a slip knot and you're going to use a 3.75 millimeter crochet hook and chain 20 Once you get 20 chains, now make a single crochet into the second chain from the hook. You can mark this first stitch with a stitch marker to keep track of your work. Now continue making single crochet in each chain all the way until end of this chain. I will meet you once I reach the end to show you the next step. So into this last chain, make 3 single crochet into that same chain and mark the middle one. Because this is going to be the tip of the bra cup. Now you are going to work on the opposite side of the chain. Make a single crochet into this very first stitch on the other side of the chain. And continue making single crochet in each stitch all the way down until the end. All the way down until you reach this stitch somewhere down here so at the end here just chain one and turn your work this is how your work must start to look like so next next you are going to start working into this very first stitch from the hook make a single crochet into this very first stitch from the hook you can mark it with a stitch marker to keep track of your work but it's very optional so now just continue making single crochet in each stitch all the way until you reach the tip here where you have marked with a stitch marker. I'll meet you once I reach this part to show you the next step. So now once you reach this part which is the tip of the bra cup, just remove the stitch marker and make 3 single crochet into that same stitch you have removed the stitch marker and always mark the middle one because that's going to be the tip of the bra cup as I said always. And that's just going to be the pattern for making bra cups, both of them. So now just continue making one single crochet in each stitch across all the way down until you reach this last marked stitch. So at the end here just remove the stitch marker and make one single crochet into that last stitch, the one you have removed the stitch marker, like that. And always remember to chain one before you turn your work. And that's just going to be the pattern. So just continue repeating round two all the way until you're satisfied with the size of your bra cup, depending to the size you are making. So make sure your bra cup is measuring at least 6.5 inches wide. So you must measure the base of the bra cup like this and it must have a total at least of 6 rows when counted like this. And this 6th row is a little bit incomplete as you can see these other rows are fully complete and this one is a little bit incomplete which means you are going to complete it the joining part. So just go ahead and chain one cut of the yarn and move on to the next bra cup. Make sure the, same, the other bra cup must also have the same endings like this so when you're going to complete this sixth row it's going to be completed with the joining part <music> 